on people it's the xbox 448 and guys the day has come so many dms so many dms on twitter on xbox live people see me playing this game right here and asking me dude what do you think about the game yeah that is right people we are doing red dead redemption 2 pretty much my first impressions of the game I didn't want to come out with a video until I really kind of got into, you know, a few missions, got got down from, you know, the mountaintops into kind of like the valley in, in which the game really takes place in. And um, here we go, guys. I I'm going to let you know exactly what I think. Before I do that, I do want to give a little context here. There was, uh, you know, for people who don't follow me, you don't follow kind of like the podcast I'm on, you know... Uh, my childhood was kind of like uh, riddled with cowboy TV shows to the point where I just I don't get into cowboy stuff, man. I, I really could do without anything cowboy. Uh, you know, um, I, I, I've stated it time and time again. My grandmother, she was like hooked on cowboy stuff. She was uh, straight off the boat from Italy. And I guess that is a thing when it comes to Italians. So, you know, a lot of them love that whole cowboy mentality, those cowboy TV shows, and, and she really wore me out with it in my childhood. Um, I'm talking like Ponderosa, Rifleman, the Rifleman, she was like in love with, with that character. Uh, um, even kind of like quasi-cowboy uh, like shows, like um, Little House on the Prairie and stuff, you know, things to have to deal back in that time but uh let's get into it guys as you can see right here from the gameplay graphics uh i, I gotta give a huge shout out to rockstar on this they they have stepped up their their um the way that their games look uh you can still kind of see traditional rockstar uh kind of like behind the scenes behind the the textures or whatnot but this is definitely a huge huge step up for rockstar in terms of how the game looks um the lighting uh the textures of the characters everything looks phenomenal uh it, it, it's it's really um a shining a shining star in terms of the the features of this game so far and i gotta say i am enjoying the way the game looks uh just wandering through the wilderness even even in the beginning because i've had some people warning me oh you you can't really say anything until after you get out of the snow and, and stuff like that but i gotta say there, there was some really really cool elements in the snow you know when when you're hunting and stuff like that that i thought were were really cool i i mean i don't think you have to give that warning out there and uh i'm surprised people did warn me about it um story wise uh there are there there's a lot a lot of horse riding like you there's no real kind of like uh quick travel or anything like that uh there is a stagecoach you could you could pay a fee and you can go to different places that you've already been and stuff like that but you even got to ride your horse to the to the stagecoach so there's a lot of horse riding if you don't like horses eh, you know what i'm saying um yo this right here <laughs> hunting this bear was insane like this this was insane i thought i was dead i didn't realize i wasn't hitting the right button um all in all, man, it, it's it's definitely a, a, a cool experience so far. I, I will say, a, uh, one of the downsides that I'm getting used to is the way they have kind of like your your menus and stuff like that. Uh, holding the right direction pad to pull up your, your satchel. Um, like, at first, I didn't know how to do it. I got like these photographs of these gunslingers. Uh, and I, I needed to examine them to see where they might be to go after them. And I didn't know where they were. Uh, stuff like that. Holding down the start button bring, brings up the map. Uh, you can also tap the start button. And of course you go into a pause menu and the map would be right there. Uh, I do like, I like the fact that you, you use um, your saddle on your horse. Like the satchels that you have on your horse. Uh, they carry your weapons. They carry inventory they carry uh, a sleeping bag stuff to camp with and stuff like that in case you're like out on your own and and you're not getting back to um, 
back to your camp in time. Uh, I think that's really cool. Alright. Uh, your gang, um, I, I think the characters all have uh, personality. They all have um, different personality. They're all pretty interesting. Um, of course, Dutch is, is the leader of your squad, and I just feel like there's always something up with him. He, he comes off as like a really cool guy, but you gotta remember at the end of the day, these, this is a, a gang of people who will rob and, and stuff like that. Um, so, I, I don't know. I think there's something up with Dutch right now. Uh, look at this fight right here. I got into a bar fight with this huge guy. That was pretty cool as well. Uh, all in all, um, I, I can't drop a verdict yet. I, I, I want to see how long this game like keeps my interest because of that whole cowboy thing. I'm not waking up early in the morning and being like, damn, I got to play Red Dead Redemption 2. Man, I got to see what's going on here and stuff like that. But I, I will say, when I put on my when I turn on my Xbox, um, there is an interest there. Uh, you know, huge shout out to, um, uh, you know, there was a gamer out there who actually sent me this code. He, he goes by the gamer tag, uh, uh, you know, black and then SS, whatever whatever that means. It's like L3ACKSS. So huge shout out to him for sending me a code. Not only that, I've actually gotten a couple codes. Uh, shout out to Vertigo, um, Vertigo Tempest as well, because he sent me an early uh, birthday present, which is really early because my birthday is in January. But he sent me a pro golf game, um, uh, the Golf Club 2019. Uh, for people who don't know, I actually get into golf games as well. Yeah, I am that big of a nerd. And uh, I've been playing that as well. I, I should definitely do a review on that game because uh, there are some significant changes to the golf club um, that like, I, I, I might want to let people know about in case they're interested in golf games. But as far as this game is concerned, you can see the, the gameplay went back to the beginning. Uh, so this is my cue to, to really put in my final first impressions here. I am having fun with the game. Uh, I went in, I customized my character, stuff like that. There are a couple uh, graphic inconsistencies that I have also recorded and picked up on. Um, either I'm going to show them at the end of this video or I'm going to wait for my review to come out. But all in all, I got to say, man, the community, yo, thank you. Because if it wasn't for the community, for, you know, the gamer to send me this code, I, I never, I wouldn't even have thought twice about playing this game. But um, I am enjoying it. All right, I have, uh, it's not a crazy kind of like obsessive interest in it. Like I don't wake up thinking about the game or anything like that, but there is an interest in, in continuing the story and see uh, exactly what's going on here. I do, I love the hunting. I think that's probably like my favorite part is like you actually got to track down the animals. Uh, you can bait them and, and stuff like that. Sit there and wait for them to take the bait. Uh, I think that's really cool almost cooler than the actual missions but that's where i am so far quick impressions uh i am into it guys let me know if you want me to do a full review of this game i want to do more reviews on my channel really let people know and and give give what i consider video games a a realistic score when it comes to these things so let me know if you want me to review uh red dead redemption 2 let me know if you feel i should beat the game completely before I do a review on it. That is another uh, interesting topic that we might tackle in the future. But hit up that comment section um, as usual, guys. If you like the gameplay, you like the topics, you know, definitely hit that thumbs up button for me. And if you haven't subscribed, definitely subscribe. I, I've seen a growth in my channel, and I gotta say it's all to you guys for, um, you know, hitting that thumbs up button, sharing my videos out, sharing out the podcast that we have, which is the next podcast. It's every Saturday at 7 p.m. And uh, thank you to the community. Oh, keep doing what you're doing. We, we are going to get this channel to grow incredibly. And, you know, it's, it's all because of you guys. So thank you so much. Uh, I appreciate it. But as for now, this is the Xbox 448. And I am definitely signing off. Get demons up out of me demons. Turn to a beast, eat your arteries beast. Deceasing opponents so properly Opponent. Unleashing the dark side, what got to me Dark. We come to take this shit over